mass story viewing Instagram strategy. What is going on Momentum fam? Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time on the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button and join the family. Drop a like, drop a comment after you finish watching this video. Okay, um, hope you guys like the new look I have going on here. You know, it's mustache Mondays. <laughs> Um, but let's get straight to it. So this video, we're going to be talking about, uh, the new Instagram strategy that people have been using to grow their accounts, right? After the latest update that just happened with Instagram, well, not really recently happened with Instagram. Um, obviously people have been trying to figure out the new ways of growth. Obviously on one of my last videos, I spoke about the Instagram celebrity, uh, growth strategy. So if you guys haven't watched that, make sure you go watch that which was one of the new ways people are growing their Instagrams right now, okay? Another one is this mass story viewing, okay? Now, what you guys are probably wondering is how can I grow followers by viewing people's stories, right? What? Do me a favor, go like this. I think I got something in my teeth. <laughs> what? You know, uh... Well, this is where the concept came from, okay? Some guy came up with the idea that, hey, if Instagram can track how many likes how many you know comments how many follows and unfollows i can do and they shut that kind of you know stream of growth down can they track how many stories i can view a day right that's where it came from and apparently not yet okay so the way this works is obviously on big numbers right it doesn't make sense if you only view 10 people's stories out of nowhere or 100 or 1000 right this is really more of on a million uh, people uh, scale. What that means is um, I personally haven't used this strategy yet and I'll tell you guys why in a bit, but I know services and I know people who are promoting it um, who are, you know, it seems like it's pretty good, okay? But just to kind of double down on the strategy here. So the way it works is obviously, you know, you they have a bot or a computer, some type of software that pretty much takes your account and starts viewing stories with it. You view 5 million stories a day, okay? 1% of that, I think, is 5,000. Okay, so if you can have 5,000 people click on your profile once they see that you viewed their story, right? Now you have somebody on your landing page, your profile, okay? They take a look at your, they take a look at your content, they take a look at your page, if they like it, they hit the follow, right? And that's really how it works is once you interact with people, people are like, oh, who's this guy, you know, or who's this girl? Let me take a look at their profile, they land at your profile, they like your content, they think you're cute, I don't know. Uh, you know, they like the value that you're providing, whatever niche it is, and they go ahead and click the follow, okay? Um, it's not like an insane strategy that'll get you thousands or hundreds of followers a day, but you could get a decent amount, I'd say anywhere between 50 to like 60 followers, obviously if you're viewing um, a lot of people, right? So over a million uh, people a day and you have the right content and the right um, uh, profile set up, right? This doesn't really work as great, I think personally, because it's not really a targeted audience, right? It's not like you're going ahead and you're gonna view people who are interested in makeup if you're a makeup page and then they're gonna click on your page and follow you, right? It's really just a bunch of random people, uh, a million random people that you're gonna be viewing their stories. And if they see you, uh, you know, on the story insights, they'll click on your profile. If they like you, they'll go ahead and follow you. And that's why this strategy really relies on volume, right? The more stories you view, the more chances you have of people clicking on your profile, checking you out, and possibly following you. And that's really how it works, okay? Who is really gonna benefit from this strategy? I personally think it's two main accounts, okay? So two types of accounts. One is anybody who has a high number of followers, I'd say over 7K. Number two is verified followers, okay? The reason behind that is one, um, people you know like the bandwagon theme, I like to say. Right? They click on your profile and you already have, let's say 7,000 followers and only following a limited amount of people. They're like, oh, this is you know somebody important or this is some type of influencer. Let me check them out. Let me click the follow, why not, right? But let's say you have 2,000 followers and you're following 1,500. They're like, okay, this is just some weirdo or some random view in my story somehow. Right? So you definitely already wanna have a good amount of followers 
uh, followers to following ratio even I'd say um, to really help you maximize the strategy okay number two is verified people why is obviously when a verified person views your account you're able to see that blue check mark when you're scrolling through your story viewers okay now for an average person that's like okay i'm viewing through my stories boom i see a blue check mark wow right let me check this person out some verified dude or girl um check my story out they end up on the page they'll probably follow you Okay, so unless you're kind of in those two categories, I really wouldn't suggest this strategy. Now, the main reason why I haven't really done this strategy um, is because simply Instagram is, it's against Instagram's algorithm. Okay, Instagram recently dropped an article, I'll leave in the link below here, but talking about really how they're uh, maximizing a lot of their efforts to be able to crack down and stop the strategy. Okay, it's against their code, it's against their policies because again, it uses software to mass view or mass like or mass follow. Anything like that is what Instagram's getting really picky on. And they're really kind of hammering down, deleting accounts, banning accounts that use any type of growth strategies that are not organic. But if you guys are interested in learning how to grow your followers organically, I definitely recommend this video right here, how I talk about how I grew 5,000 followers in about three weeks. Uh, another video right here on how to really start making money with the followers that you have, right? Again, I wouldn't recommend people to start growing their Instagram unless they have a product to sell or they know how to monetize their audience, okay? If not, it does not make sense for you to grow. Um, if you are looking to try this strategy out, which I wouldn't really recommend, but why not if you really wanna do it? Feel free to reach out to me. I mean, I have no problem sending you guys in the right direction. But again, it is against Instagram policies, so be aware. Hope you guys found this video useful. Now you know why you have a bunch of random people viewing your stories, if you're like me. Um, and yeah, see you guys on the next video. Peace.